the the elbow on the on the left side is okay, but the right arm is 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 less quality. What is it? I think like this. Was you it see? used to be better? When I was Olympic champion, yes, absolutely, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that was a little bit better, yeah. I, I, I used to focus a lot on the technique when I was focusing on the uh, Olympic Games 10, 10 kilometers. Nowadays, when I focus on the ultra distance, for example, the, the 200 kilometers 11 city tour I swam. Uh, I did not focus on technique at all. It was only uh, making lots of hours, stretching the amount of hours you can make. Um, and I think technique and focus, it's, it's finding the easiest way of swimming, I think. That my legs do not do a thing, so there's not coming any speed from my legs to spare energy. I would like to tell you it's something you can learn and I think partly it is because it has something to do with your, your core stability and, and, and um, uh, using that muscle in the right way that you, your, your legs stay up. I think the major reason why I'm that high in the water is that my uh, my lung capacity is is huge? I think even for my height, uh, I think six liter of lung capacity is like average, and my lung capacity is 12 liters. So I'm just uh, I, I I have a lot of air here, so I just lay higher uh, on on top of the water. I can breathe left and right, but normally I uh, breathe every, every stroke uh, and that makes it a little bit easier as well. Uh, and because uh, my body is quite buoyant, uh, I think my advantage of breathing on two sides is a little bit less because uh, breathing on two sides it helps you to, to, to stay stable. But to do those long distances, you really need your oxygen to, to, to swim as well. So I do a lot of uh, one breath per, per stroke, uh, but I can breathe left as, as, as well right. I think I always had this like searching for, for the best catch. I think now it's a little bit even more turning around and searching. But I think to, to search, search grip on the water, I think it's a good thing. But I think if you, if you made this shot 12 years ago, where I swam four hours every day, I think the grip is, is, is better. You see lots of uh, air drops when I get into the water not that smooth holds your your hands like this I can I can imagine it uses like these muscles more and I can I can imagine that I just got used to dropping in a bit to to make it easier but it, of course it doesn't help no? I think about next meetings, I think about my, my daughters, my wife, uh, I think about fun stuff doing the 11th city too. I was watching all those people uh, besides the water and I, 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 I looked at them and, and sometimes I was surprised what, what they were wearing. Uh, but I think most of the time it feels like, like meditation almost. And I do not think about uh, anything and I'm just swimming in peace. And actually that's quite a nice thing to do then. I would say swimming in open water is not as safe as swimming in a swimming pool. So please be safe, take a, a swimming partner with you. Um, do not swim in the dark. Uh, and to make it even uh, safer, uh, build it up very easy.